Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In a previous video, we had seen how to display the records from a grid view control to a particular text box, like this. And now we will continue with the radio button and the designation. Here are the two radio buttons, one for male and one for female I have taken. And in the designation, there are few designations. So uh, when I will select a particular row, then a checkbox should be checked. If like I will select this one, then gender is a female. So female radio button should be checked. And if I will select the third row, it means male, then the male radio button should be checked. And same with the designation. So here I'm going to stop my application and continue with this one. We have select all the rows from the grid view and stored in a row variable and pass this value to the particular text box. And now for the radio button, I'm going to take one string type variable named S and row dot cells of continue with the index in index 0 we have employee name index 1 we have a mobile number and index 2 we have a address so in index 3 there is a gender we will fetch the value and check the condition if s equals to equals to mail then radio button one dot checked equals to true else radio button two dot checked equals to true it is as simple and run this I'm going to select the third row and the text is mail so the mail checkbox will be checked and I'm going to select the this one then the female will be checked so this is for the radio button and now for the combo box same thing we will take a one variable and it is of a string type and row dot cells of next index is four dot value dot to string and we will store as a combo box text so combo box one dot text equals to designation is the name of our variable save it and run this so I am going to select the third row so its text will be displayed here the administrator is displayed and so on thank you so much for watching if you liked it please subscribe my channel